Hey, how's everybody doing? Exo, a company best known for bringing the latest tech to gamers, sent over their flagship wireless gaming headset, the E910, for review. Feature rich specs including zero wireless latency, 7.1 surround sound, noise cancelling, and retractable unidirectional microphone. Let's see what all the noise is about. <music> Inside the box you get the E910 wireless gaming headset, a gaming stand that's easy to assemble, the 5.8GHz USB dongle, a 3.5mm audio cable, a Type-C charging cable, leather carry pouch to put everything in, and a basic user manual. If you're familiar with the E900 series, you might have noticed that the E910 design has been dialed down a little with an all black design aside from the red Esca logo LED lighting on either side of the headset when you turn it on. The inner ear fabric is in a vibrant red colour. There's a solid stainless steel band covered with a leather fabric that runs from left to right with enough flex to fit comfortably on most head sizes. The headband and ear muffs have generous memory foam padding and an easy to wipe PU leather fabric to clean down those long gaming sessions. The fork that connects the headband to the ear cups is made of a strong aluminium alloy. The ear cups have a geometric triangle design on the outside giving that subtle gaming look. The build quality is excellent at this price range. Everything feels solid and sturdy to take a knock or two. The padding fabric and stitching is first rate. Again for this budget price you can't argue with the quality and finishing. The only small concern or question mark is the two curly wires connecting the headband to each ear cup. It feels like it will snap if you snag them. The included headstand is easy to assemble. Connect the three parts and you have a nice fairly sturdy stand to drop your headset to show off on your desk. The left speaker has all the buttons and controls. From the bottom you have a USB Type-C charging port and a power on off button. Turn the headset on or off, you have to long press this button. When powered on this button can be used to switch between stereo mode and surround mode with a single press. Next to the power button is a mic mute button, LED indicator and volume control wheel. Compared to the E900, the E910 has a detachable noise cancelling microphone. Hide the microphone by pushing it into the speaker when you just want to listen to a Spotify playlist or watch YouTube in private. Pull it out if you want to speak during a Discord group conversation or a gaming session. The E910 feels light in your hand when you first pick it up, even at 305 grams. There's plenty of adjustment on the headband to fit most head sizes, including my big head. It's generally comfortable to wear these for several hours listening to your Spotify playlist or multiplayer action with COD. Odd times I had to release the headset off my head to give my ears a rest, but that's true of every headset I've tried. The 5.8 GHz wireless dongle performed perfectly with the headset during testing, plugs into a USB Type-A port and works with most gaming devices such as a Windows PC, Mac, Chromebook, Xbox One, PlayStation 4 or 5 and Nintendo Switch. The transceiver has a 3.5mm headphone jack to connect it to your smartphone with the included audio cable. On a Windows 7, 10 or 11 device it's child's play. Plug in a dongle to a spare USB port, long press the power button on the headset and voila. The headset is set as the default for speakers and the microphone. If you want to listen to 7.1 virtual surround sound and adjust the sound quality, download and install the driver software. More on this later. Having said everything so far, the proof of the pudding is the sound quality. The E910 features 50mm dynamic drivers with a frequency range of 20Hz to 20kHz. My first test was to plug in the USB transceiver into a Windows or Chromebook laptop, open the Spotify app and listen to a playlist while sitting 6 meters away on a the sofa. There was no lag in the audio transmission. The playback music quality was extremely solid and very balanced. Personally I would argue it's slightly bass heavy, which for some will love this feature. Overall, it's in the category of great all-rounder for music audio quality. Gaming wise, if you combine the virtual 7.1 surround sound driver on your Windows PC, easily switch between the stereo sound mode and surround sound mode by clicking the power button, then fire up Call of Duty Modern Warfare London Mission. Makes gaming so much more immersive and realistic. The microphone performance and sensitivity was average at best. The mic isn't detachable and that long for certain face sizes, so it was disappointing that the mic sensitivity isn't that great at normal voice volume. Even when I raised my voice, people on the other end heard me as being tinny and quiet. However, it does allow for the mic to retract into the headset when you don't need it, and the microphone boom is flexible to get the best position. Another bonus is the ENC or environmental noise cancellation feature. There's a hidden ENC microphone in the left speaker that captures the surrounding noise and cancels or minimizes it when you're gaming or live streaming. ESSA have provided 7.1 surround sound tuning software for Windows users to precisely tune the audio output. 
The software has three main tabs, 7.1 surround sound game, stereo sound music, and mic ENC. The surround sound and stereo sound modes have audio presets like for first person shooting games or pop music, or you can create your own custom audio profile using the equalizer. Works really well for games and music streaming. The headset reaches full charge after two hours using the provided USB-C charging cable and will last a total of approximately nine to 10 hours. Not bad compared to the competition. Two small bugbears is the charging port might not fit all USB-C cables as I found out moving it between the workplace and home. Plus it would be nice to have a battery level indicator light. You only have a few audio beeps before it dies. Essa E910 is a wireless headset well suited to casual gamers who listen to music predominantly thanks to the retractable microphone and subtle gaming look. Built quality is excellent at this price range and the well padded headset is comfortable to use for hours. The included stand and bag is a bonus and it's mainly plug and play with the wireless dongle avoiding the need to install any drivers to make it work. Ok the battery life and microphone could be better but always forgiven by the audio performance. Music sound quality is fantastic throughout and well balanced. Whether you're listening to be loved by a or bass heavy titles like Smells Like Teen Spirit. Gaming wise if you combine the virtual 7.1 surround sound, zero wireless latency and the ENC eliminating 90% of surrounding noise you get standout features for affordable price. Overall the Esca E910 is a worthy wireless music and gaming headset at an amazing price point. What do you guys think? Leave your comments and discuss below. Hope you guys enjoyed the review of the Esca E910 wireless gaming headset. Please click on the like button if you enjoyed this review video and subscribe if you would like to watch more of our tech videos. Thanks for watching. Cheers.